Hey, what's going on? John and Kate, the Cheap Car Collector here. And today we, uh, we're doing a little something different. Um, so we have another PSA submission, but I'm going to show the cards we're submitting now, what grades I think we're going to get, and then I'm going to stitch these two videos together with the reveal. So if you're watching now, that means I've already gotten the cards, but this is before our submission. I'm going to show you what we submitted, and uh, we'll see what we get. It's a little different format. So. Hope you're all doing well today. If you like what you see, like the video, subscribe to the channel. We love doing this kind of stuff, and uh, let's get into it. So, I have 23 cards here, all sports. Um, this is October, so there is no special, unfortunately. I think they're probably trying to get through their backlog. So, no real specials of note. So, these are coming going in at the um, the collector's uh, membership value bulk. So, not too bad. Um, so, we have 23 21? 21 cards. Um, yeah, 21 cards. So let's see what we get. All right, let's see what we're submitting. So first one is this Clayton Kershaw. This is the gold version of the uh, 2007 Bowman. So this is his... Uh, 2008 his tops is his rookie, but this is the 2007 Bowman um, gold card. So the gold one's pretty... I'm sorry, 2008. This is 2008. Sorry, 2007. 2008. Um, so the gold card's pretty uh, worth more. The, the regular Bowman... Is not the chrome is, is worth a little bit but the gold one is actually pretty value card so I'm um, gonna submit this one the corners look a little just a little rough I, I, but they're pretty good it's a centering I think it's a little um, little top to bottom left right looks pretty good so hoping for a nine for this one um, I, I'll be okay with an eight but I think let's, we're gonna go for a nine for that one so let's hopefully get that all right this the next one this one says 2008 Stadium Club rookie card so this is a uh, his variation of him throwing um, and it's number to 999. So this one is a the regular one, the first issue, are both good cards, but this one is pretty valuable. I think this is a hobby version. So um, again, it's numbered. Um, nice card. Uh, it's, it's pretty clean that you can see some marks, but that's like that's the top loader. Um, there's one corner that's a little white. Um, this is more of the PC. So if we get an eight, I'm fine with that. Uh, I think it, it could get an eight. There's no centering, obviously. The corners look pretty good. Um, but yeah, I think it's a pretty clean card. So. That's for the PC, but you know we'll see. So I think we'll hopefully get an eight there. All right. So this is a, and this is interesting. So this is a two thousand and five, two thousand five, uh, two thousand six, two thousand six Albert Pujols Fleer Ultra Gold. So this card is a I got for a couple of bucks. Um, there's some nines. There's no tens, but you know Albert Pujols has got people collect this. There's not a uh, pop report. There's not a lot of tens or nines or really graded cards. But it's really clean. If you look, there's there's no centering, obviously, but the edges look good, the corners look good. So I'm submitting this one. I, I love a 10, but I'm perfectly fine with a 9. So um, we'll submit that one. Really nothing wrong with that card, as far as I can tell. All right. So the next three, um, so we've been on this Billy Wagner kick, as you noticed. Um, you know, he's on track for the Hall of Fame next year, maybe. Um, and, you know, his, his value is slowly going up, but I think uh, we're still ahead of the game. So this is his tops, or sorry, his Bowman rookie. Um, again, for for a car, I think this is 94. Uh, let's see. Yeah, 94. It's pretty clean, if you can tell, um, for an old car. The corners are nice. Nothing on the edges. Um, really nothing wrong with this one. So we're going to submit that one. Um, and then we have two. So this is the Bowman Best Blue. Again, he, he has a few rookie cards, being this is sort of the end of the Junk Wax era, but this is one of the main ones. Um, again, not a lot going on here. Uh, corners look good. Edges look good. Um, as well as this one. They both look, in my view, pretty clean. Um, so we're going to submit both of those. Not much of a market for these, um, but um, there is some value with the 9s and the 8s. So, I mean, if I think, so it's, you know, with these old cards, I'd love to get a 9. Hope for a 9 for all three, but I would take 8s, to be honest. Um, even 7s might be okay, but but 8 or 9s is what we're looking for. So this card, you know, if you watch my channel, you know it very well. This is probably my favorite card of all time. This is a Clayton Kershaw Tops Update uh, rookie. Um, so we got three of them. This is the first one, um, pretty centered, a little bit left to right maybe, but the corners, the surface, everything looks great um, on that one. Then you've got this one. Uh, this, I mean, looks perfectly centered to me. Um, maybe a little left to right, maybe 45, 55, but again, looks pretty good. Corners look good, surface looks good. And then this one here, same thing, um, pretty centered, maybe a little 45, 55. Corners look great, edges look great. I see nothing wrong with these three. So 
I would say these are my PC, but I actually kept one that I created last time. But again, I'm I'm, ho I'm okay to keep multiple ones just because it's it's my favorite card. Um, all right, so here is a Max Scherzer rookie. So we got this uh, the base uh, again. Not as valuable as Kershaw, but I mean it looks pretty clean to me. Perfectly centered, left to right, corners look good, everything looks good. So um, this one. So sorry, let me backtrack. I keep forgetting. So these I want. I leave, I think we should get 110. Uh, three nines would be great, but but uh, hopefully at least 110 would be amazing. So I'm gonna say two nines and a ten for that. The shirts are uh, I, I got a ten before. I mean these are to me these are fairly easy cards to grade. I mean they're they're clean. The white helps uh, you know with with seeing imperfections. I, I think this could be a ten, but we'll, we'll say nine or ten. Um, <laughs> I can never really hope for a ten. Now this is an interesting card. So this is the gold version. So this is a card I've been dreaming about for the Kershaw. It's way too expensive because Max isn't expensive. This was not too bad. So this is a gold version. Um, Fairly rare, uh, number to 208, 208, but again, not that many. So there's a little white thing there. I might try to clean up, but other than that, it's look, it's pretty centered. Um, a little left to right, but again, we only need an eight for this, I think, uh, to be okay. So I want to say an eight, maybe a seven or eight, possibly nine, but we'll go seven or eight. Again, it looks pretty clean. For a gold card, the corners look nice, so we'll do seven or eight for that. Um, this, now this is one of the my chase cards, my grail cards. So this is the red... Redemption, Red Hot Redemption rookie can claim Kershaw. So I really wanted this card. I splurged a bit and got it. Um, it looks clean. I mean, little little centering left, right, but the corners look great. The edges look great. It looks amazing. The surface looks great. So I don't really care what I get for this. It's gonna I'm gonna PC it, um, but I'm hoping to get eight or nine. A ten would be incredible. Um, very few of those, very valuable. But I'll take eight or nine to be honest. Uh, I hope for that. Um, so this is the. the LeBron tops. This is uh, 2006, I believe. So this is third year card. Yeah, third year card. Um, again, looks pretty centered. Um, clean card, and again, not a lot of these graded. It's a third year LeBron card. Um, you know, not really popular, but I do think long term in 50 years, this is the kind of stuff that people are gonna want, right? LeBron James, uh, like how Jordan is today. So granted, he's got a lot more. So. Um, I'm hoping for a 10 on this one. I mean, I, again, it, it's clean, centered, corners are great. So we'll see 9 or 10 on that. This is the 2005. So this, this is, uh, so that's his f fourth year. This is his third year. Um, so again, very much centered, clean, sharp corners, nothing on the surface. So I'm going to say 9 or 10 on that. And then we have a second year, it's 2004 tops. So we've got two of these, um, both fairly centered, both very clean, um, corners, edges, everything, surface. So I wanna say nine or 10 for these. Um, <clears throat> moving on, we still have LeBron. So this is his bazooka. I guess there's a bazooka, bazooka set, 2003. There's all these variations of his rookie card. This is the red road jersey. Um, again, very clean, corners, everything looks good. Uh, it's, uh, it's a little off centered a bit, so I think I'd be okay with an eight, and then actually we do okay um, from what I paid. So we're gonna go eight or nine, um, possibly for a ten. But I know sometimes they give tens for being a slight off center, but I don't think so. We're gonna say that's eight or nine. Um, this is one of my favorite cards. This is the Kobe Bryant 2008 update. You know why is this a special card? Well, if you look at it, it's got LeBron on it, so it's a very kind of card for a base card. Um, centered corners look good, surface looks good, everything. So I'm gonna say nine or ten on this one. Although we really, excuse me, we only need an eight really, but I think it's a nine or 10. And then this, so this is another famous card. This is a 2008 LeBron, um, gold foil, right? So it's gold foil variation. You see his name, it's a little more valuable. Um, I think it's pretty centered, it's clean. And obviously it's a famous chalk throw. So it's a, it's a, I think it's a card that, you know, 20, 30 years from now people are gonna want. So again, very clean. So, um, so yeah, so that's, that's a card. I'm gonna submit these tomorrow. We'll see how long it takes. I know it's, it's been a month or two, and then we'll uh, compare with what we got. All right, <clears throat> the moment has arrived, and we finally have our grades for this submission. So, uh, first half of the video was a submission back in October, and now we are uh, here in uh, 12 to December 21st, so about two months. So let's see what we got. This is the grand reveal, I have not seen this. It's all for the best. All right, here we go. So first card, we got a Kershaw Bold and Gold. Kind of the piece for the PC, but we'll see. Uh, all right, seven, not too bad. A little off-centered, some corner wear, so it's all right. PC card, all right, so this is a Kershaw uh, variation of Stadium Club. It's numbered, so it's a rarer version. 
Um, had some wear and tear for the PC again, so seven right will be good. All right, we'll take a seven. Not a big deal. <clears throat> That's expected. All right, to the Zebra pool holes. Uh, I'm a little concerned about that. It's crooked in the case, but uh, it looked clean. Um, but I guess it's hard card to gray, I think. So maybe a, I'm gonna guess a seven, but eight would have been, eight would be good. Oh, eight, there you go, okay. <clears throat> Not a lot of these, low pop. So hopefully uh, you can find a nice pools collector for that. Um, all right, so I got a bunch of Billy Wagners uh, probably making the Hall of Fame, high on him. Um, love watching him as a kid. Uh, also crooked, but it's fine. So this is Bowman, so nine will be great, ten will be amazing. But we'll take eights. Alright, eight. <clears throat> Pretty good. I think I paid like a buck for this card, so it's fine. Uh, and I got two Bowman's best. Uh, a lot nicer card. Um, again, nine would be great. Eight would be okay. Alright, eight. Not bad. And I had one more, I think. Yeah, one more. So let's hold for a nine. Nine would be great. Make a decent money there. Yeah. All right, nine. Okay, this is the first good card we've got so far. Take that. All right, so uh, my favorite card, Kershaw, Tops Update 2008. Uh, graded three of these. Um, nines would be good, at least 110. I agree, I submitted three. They all look really nice, but, so 110 would be good. Nines and tens would be good. Uh, all right, an eight, a little off-centered. Um, all right, says number two, so we got nine or ten, would be good. All right, good nine, that's good. All right, come on ten. I had, I, I figured one of these would get a ten. I really hope so. Yes. All right, perfect. So that's good. That's really good. All right, ten. Okay, so this is Max Scherzer. Same set is regular. Six. Ugh. Yeah, I don't get that one. That's pretty centered. I guess we'll see when I get it back. Also, man, they're really crooked. Okay, this one's. This is his gold, um, numbered to 2000, 2008. Um, a little off centered, but. So eight would be good. Seven. Okay, it's not bad. <coughs> nice card. All right, so this next card, this is uh, one of my Chase cards, one of my Kurt from my Kershaw collection. This is the Red Hot Rookies, 2008 tops. Um, this is a redemption card. I think you don't get these two redemptions, so not a lot uh, around. Um, it, the back is off center, but the front look really good. So I was hoping for a nine, and nine would be great. Uh, an eight would be fine because it's for my PC, but nine would be really good. Um, so let's see what we got. Ah. Oh! Oh my god. Wow. All right, th th this is by far the best card I've ever gotten back. Uh that's that's I even think about 10. That's insane. Um I don't even know one soul in the past couple years. So that's that's awesome. Um which is funny cuz it's a little centered, but it it was clean. So <laughs> That's that's awesome. I'll take that. All right, so next card we got this LeBron James, 2006 top. So this is his fourth year, I think. Um, I got for like a dollar. Uh, I I just think LeBron early years is worth having, so I took a chance. Um, so I mean, nine will be fine, ten will be great. I thought I had a chance at a ten. Uh, awesome. All right, so out of ten, it's a paper version. It's not the Chrome, but still good. So I'll take that. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, so this is 2005. This is third year I think um, again nine be good all right nine that's fine that's fine um, I thought this one had a t chance at a 10 it's pretty centered but that's okay all right so this is 2004 second year this one's a hard one to grade I've had I've graded a few of these and have not haven't had good luck um, so but I'd love a nine but something tells me this is gonna be an eight if that Let's see <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't I don't get it. It's perfectly centered. The corners look fine. I guess I'll take a look. I don't get it. But because of those tens I got, especially the red hot rookie, I don't I don't I'm good. I'm in a good mood. Another one. So if they gave me five, this one's gotta be a seven. Eight. Okay, it's a little better. Still weird though. Alright, so the next next card is the LeBron James rookie bazooka. 
red uh, red jersey. Um, another rookie card. I thought it looked pretty clean. Could have got a 10. Okay, 9. I like this card. It's just a nice looking card. Okay, so this is this is one of my favorite cards. This is a Kobe Bryant with LeBron on it. So first, the, the card with both of them. I think this is going to be iconic down the road. Um, I thought this looked clean. Again, I, you can never guess a 10, but at least a 9. 10 would be amazing, though. All right. That's awesome. So 10. That's a great card. Just a great card. Um, worth good money, too. All right, this is the, the run-in gold foil. So this, this is the chalk tossing card. Um, mm -hmm. I thought it looked clean. It's hard. It's funny, this card with the chalk, it's hard to tell the surface. So, I hope a 9. I... <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Anytime we get a 4. I mean, look, it's centered. It's corners are good. I don't know. All right, that's the video. Hope you guys enjoy that. Um, apology for the editing. I kept getting alerts and notifications popping up, so I had to keep uh, recording pieces of it. But uh, yeah, great submission, and uh, we will try again in a couple months, see if we can do it again. Hope you enjoy that. Take care.